Zeal Entertainment. Greetings, boys and girls. I am Andy Dion from Zeal Entertainment. And today we are here for another episode within Morrowind. With me and our character here, Sarah. We have a guy trying to kill us out here, but he's he's pretty much failing hardcore. I'm thinking on just handling this myself. I, I it, it, yeah. Um, firebite not might not work. I might have to go with frost. Lay of the land, the day drop. Oh boy, oh boy. Those things are way too powerful. Isn't that a great start? One minute in and we already die. I did not see any I did not see anything there last time I came out, so that is uh that's very sad. Um So we are going to have to summon one of these. Or run. And you're just a ghost, so I'm not afraid of you. Take one of them take another and then you can take a ghost and then you I'll take out myself what guys what the hell is your problem you're making me take out the ghost What? What? The danger wasn't able to take that out? It should. It took one out before. Why is my ghost coming after me? Oh, it's not mine. You guys! My god, you guys suck. Make me do it all myself. I didn't expect to have a jam-packed episode this time, but whatever. And we're gonna add just... I'm just gonna go all out and do this. Holy shit, this guy's tough. All my people cannot take him out. Uh oh, we're screwed. No, 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 no. Whoa, 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 whoa. Fucking scared me there. I don't know what the hell happened there. It's like I hit a brick wall and I just stopped moving. That was crazy. I don't know what to do about that guy. I can't believe... I had a Dremora take him out before, but not now, apparently. And those things aren't going to help, but i rather have a distraction. And maybe I can do a bit of cold with him. There we go. I probably took them out myself. They came close. But not close enough. Is this the place I'm thinking about? Worshipper. I'll take that. Restore health. You should have used that. Is this the place I'm thinking about? There's this really weird thing that takes you to the very end of the area. 
and then you had to work your way back up to this area to the where you would think this would lead you out to it takes you to the end Hmm. I didn't actually want that. So yeah, we would have to mark right here and then go in. And now it's late night. We would have to go that way, but like I said, it's nighttime. We need a place to stay. So once again, we have to go to Caldera. And from here, we're going to go to the uh, tavern. Too bad that doesn't have a, a shrine up there. Uh, where do I restore my magicka at then? Bed. Yes. Do you have any other food that's not, like, bread? No. <laughs> Alright. Man. Not even ten minutes in and we already had, like, the most extreme fight I've had in pretty much the whole game. Uh, I think uh, nine hours shall do. Level up, interesting. Speed is good. Um, strength is good. Intelligence is good. And that might be the last one I do for strength. Intelligence has to go up more. I'm not doing willpower anymore. Agility will go up at least 10 maybe. Personality I'll have go up as well. And endurance I'll have go up well. And luck since I might as well have something. And it's 6 a.m. So I'm going to go and divine. Keep moving. Shut up. Where are we? Oh, old Drune. So we need to go this way. Indeed. It's funny. It's not the name that I'm like, oh, I know that name. It's the look of the place inside that I'm like, oh, okay, I get it. I know where I'm at now. Um, we're in Aldrune. Uh, let's alm Sivy to the Mages Guild. And then we can go back to Caldera. And in Caldera, we can go back to the plays. And let us hope that the Daedroth has not respawned, or we're screwed. Actually, I probably would just have to place down a few um, distractions and get the hell out of there. In fact, that's what I would do, is just run away. Do we have anything to place here? Oh, uh, we have these potions. Yeah, let's go to Balmora first. It's a whole new episode, so we can do stuff like that. No, not Vivek. Well, good thing I have money. Balmora. Um, Sivvy, because we're lazy, and then from here we can just walk over here. Not sure why I haven't done that before. I think there was a spell I wanted to make, but I can't remember what. We already did the key one, that's the only one that really mattered. We did the, or we tried to do the levitate, but that didn't work out very well. And I don't know. I can't think of anything else. All right, fifteen hundred. That is wondrous. 
and then you can have that as well and that and that and that i didn't know we had grief i thought we just had sheen shane 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 sounds like a name sheen sounds pervy actually all right so that is five hundred five six seven twenty two twenty three seventy five twenty four hundred so I think that an eighteen hundred is good because that's what we got for the um stuff yep she's just trying to cheat us out of two hundred gold, but this character learned to get things for what they're worth. Even though she doesn't need or want the money, get what you need and work, get what you, uh, get, get things for what they are worth. Hope you enjoy your new clothes. Alright, let's see if there's anything we can get rid of here. I don't really want that. I never used the shield belt, but I'm going to try it at least once just to see like how good it might possibly be. Oh, and you can have these. Um, I'm going to have to take something back though. Maybe this. And what else is kind of cheap? These. Max sell. Thank you. Goodbye. Time to go to Caldera, actually. I think we're done here. Indeed. I know it is. That's how awesome I am. Indeed. Indeed, indeed. Everybody just seems to love us now. All right, you, indoor. All right, so we'll need to go that way. Good, it didn't respond. Yeah, I'm going the right way. Actually, I think we follow this path and we'll get to where we need to be. Not sure which person's quest this is. There's Yakin, and that's for um, Shink. And there's Namu, and that's for the lady at the Imperial Cult. I've gotten the ring before. Because, um, by the by, this place is right along the coast. Right along the shore. That will take us to Mu Namu, I believe, but. Or Na Yakin, whichever one it is. Whichever place is which, I just know that they're all in this area. Hello. Almost took you out with one shot. Can't wait till the day that happens.
Don't have to worry about that. That guy's over there. I like how the sound of collecting something properly sounds like you should be failing. Like, I think they made the sound effects backwards. Come on, give me that. But maybe that's just me? I don't know. I am weird. This is exciting. There's a place we need to go to. I'm hoping it is Namu because Namu is a little bit easier than the Shink quest. And I might be once again yelling about the game. Alright, we have some. Uh... What is this stuff? So this is, this is, uh, hmm, this is, uh, Shink's quest. Six health people are usually very difficult. Corpus, huh? Let us get that burns out. There we go. I did that in a proper funny way. So this is what I would think the zombies would be in this game. Shouldn't have touched them because I could have gotten the thing and then that would not have uh, been good. But yeah, you would think those are considered zombies in the game, but apparently they're not. And it's the bone walkers. That's supposed to be the zombie in the game. Wait, no, that's not a bone walker. That's just a different corpus stalker. Fucking. I see. This is why I want a ring of mark. Why do they have to be so expensive with everything? Well, we have to take them out. We have to take them out. And we have to do the rest of this without magic, because I'm not fucking coming back here. <coughs> Isn't it great that I can never fucking find magicka potions in this goddamn game? Is this a bone walker? Let's make sure. Okay, it's just a corpus walker. So. Alright. Come along. Get me the good health potion. No. I said good. I guess we don't have any more. Come on. Can I use... Uh, well, first of all... And second of all... Okay, I didn't need that. I thought I did. I thought I saw my health going down. And then we'll also get this. Guys, keep him occupied so I can 
go at him when he's not sent. What the fuck? Really? Yeah, you are lame. Fucking zombie. This zombie is way more difficult than others. Um, by the by, I kind of have to restart the game because there's no way I can do this. So, let's load. Maybe I can figure it out somehow because that's too far back. But, I don't know how. Okay, let's get rid of these, even though they're not that heavy. <sighs> fucking hell, stupid shitty game, I fucking hate it. Alright. Let's make a potion. Come on, nice and quick. Our intelligence will go up quite a lot. That helped out a very little. Uh, fuck, I forgot to put these books down. Four, well, I can do it now. And then when I need to, I can come back and pick them up. I can sell one of those books in there. get rid of this bucket for now wait no I stole it so they might know somehow I uh, yeah I'll quick save and then when I place down the bucket maybe okay I can place it down um still 15 pounds overweight it's great we have a lot of different restore health potions. Not sure why they couldn't stack them. Oh, we can. That way my inventory isn't as fucking cluttered. I have a fuck ton of health. That's awesome. They're in different potion like things. I kind of would like the idea. It's a little difficult, but it would make the game a little bit more fun. I mean, it, the game's already difficult enough, so it might as well add something interesting. It'd be cool if you had to actually buy your own bottles. And then you were able to. You reuse them, basically. What did I do to deserve this honor? Indeed, I don't know, bro. These are way too light. It's kind of weird. Um, <sighs> she needs a drink. Fuck. We're gonna have to start taking clothes off. I think. One, two, three, two, three, four, seven. Eight nine. That's nine pounds. That's still not enough. Fucking what else do we And it's not even taking them off, I would have to place them down on the ground. I don't understand.
Well, these guys here are going to get a show. I still can't move. What are we supposed to do? Why are the arms looking weird? So much for better bodies. I guess I can place this stack of stuff down. Let's hope. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah, he likes it. Or maybe they're just gay. Alright, I think we're good with... I didn't restore our attributes. There we go. Our strength is back to normal. Oh, I forgot to read a book. And then she's just like, yeah, don't mind me. Honestly, she wouldn't care, so I don't know why I should. Uh, hand, hand, and shirt. Is that really the best shirt there is? No, that's right, exquisite. Where the hell? I'm going to actually have to look up where to buy a good clothing, because that's just pathetic. Like, I still haven't found where I can get exquisite clothes. Uh. And sadly, we now have to go back to that place. So we had to run there. Luckily, it's not too bad. So, not you. It's you? Where's the teleporter? What the hell happened? Where's the teleporter? Aren't you? Yeah, what, what the hell? Why did you give me things to buy or something? That was weird. Alright. Work. Endor and now y'all. Endor. Enduranian. Indoranian, actually. Yeah, it's Indoranian, not indoor. Indoranian. So all along this is the place where we where that one weird place is. The backwards caverns, I guess. It's kinda cool. I think you do have to cast a mark, like right outside the door, because it actually, even if you hit the door, it seems to, I think, if I remember, I think it just like hits you back to the beginning, aka the end of the area, so you can't actually get out or something weird like that. It actually is what gave me an idea for one of my video games. Where you enter this guy's door and you end up in his backyard. So you end up at his back door and that's how you enter. Which sounds pervy when I say it that way. There's a little hut with some people. But we have no cares or worries about them. Okay, they're just dead. I don't have to worry. What was that? I'm not wearing anything good. Somehow forgot these. Oh, because I went down there. Alright, I'm gonna try... There we go. And then I'm going to... Mark. Quick save. 
uh, light. And then I'm gonna find a way to destroy this piece of shit. Which basically is gonna be me doing this. And... You suck. Not in a power-wise, powerful. In a power type of sense, you didn't suck. You were too good. That used up almost all my magicka. I'm hoping to find a dead end. I don't want to go the way that we need to. Crap, that's what we need to soul trap. Those weird penis elephant noses. So I'll go up this way instead. Camp. Hey, naked girl! Wait, did she find actually see me? Peekaboo! I see you. Anyways, um, enough fooling around. Divine it is. Sajith Mora, good. I bet you would. I bet you would. After seeing my character naked, of course you would be happy. Let's get the stamina going. And then get that. And then let's recall. So now I can run and still have a decent amount of stamina. So, I'm going to need distractions for this guy. That guy is more difficult than that one, so... Oh, speaking of which... You guys... That's why he's difficult, is because he has so much powers. But I think it disappears after some time. And then let's go with this. Um, that didn't work out. And then... Fuck, he's really strong. Even from hitting. Just one hit kills them. He doesn't even need the Magicka. That one hit kill, he's like, I don't care about you. Okay, I do need to soul trap him though. And then it maybe we have enough for one more. Ooh, a hammer. We're good. What? How did you do that? No, not that. I need one more of these. No. Fucking piece of shit of a game. How the hell did that get- I thought Dramora was supposed to be the toughest enemy in the game. Why am I keeping this shitty amulet if it's not doing anything good for me? It's good with enemies that I'm just- like too lazy to take care of 
But the ones that it should take care of, it's just being a piece of dog shit. I have to take care of this asshole again. Alright, quick save. And then divine. All right. Greetings to you. Indeed. Pleasure to meet you. Well met. Indeed. Get the hell out of my way. Okay. Do this. And then let's go with stamina. And then let's do this again. And then let's recall. So now I can just run and not worry about my stamina. It's a good idea. So I'm going to exhaust all of my enemies. And then... Actually, I'm going to take them all... I'm going to bring them all out, including my main guy. And then I'm going to cast Soul Trap. That was not the one I wanted to trap. It's not the one I want to trap. It's not the one I want to soul trap. Once again, that's not the one I want to soul trap. Oh, last second. You guys did it properly this time. Ooh. Ooh, I did it. I would try to destroy you and get your soul, but that guy would attack me. And you would kill me anyways. Ah, fuck it. I would take you out, but... You're just gonna kill me. Well, I did quick save, so. What about Fireball? That's not very good. He's just like, what? What's? What's that? He's like, are you trying to hurt me? Uh, if we had more Magicka, we could have had a, a soul trapped of a Dramora. That's sad. There's no way I can take him out with this. Yeah. Alright, dude. Anyways, we have taken care of... Major's Guild Quest of Soul of an Ash School. Which we did. I'm gonna see if there's any other kind of loot in here. Probably not. Probably not. There's a shrine. Oh, I thought you were an enemy. Oh, they're gonna take him out. Yeah. Bye! Thank goodness this is an oblivion. Oh, what am I doing? Divine. Oh, I should have casted my uh, soul trap on him. One of the I have many soul traps. I could have used this oh, to cast one strike, but I could have found 
I probably have like a scroll. Probably should have done that. Or what I could have done is come here, get my magicka back up, and then real call back, and then get the fuck out of my way. I just said that like Ron White. Um Oh and let's heal. Heal. Stamina, please. And let's get this crappy thing off. Restore Magicka. And then let's recall. Alright. Recall. Alright. Recall. Alright. Recall. And... Though... The other one is actually... Basically, if since I was here, I probably should have teleported here and then go there. Because it's kind of closer, it's kind of straight... Well, it's... Yeah, it's like right there or something. Basically, we can get there from just following along the coastline. Ugh. Who's attacking? Nobody. Sounded like it was about to go into, like, fight mode music. Is that a guar, a rock, or an alet? It's a rock. Good. Now we have an enemy. Oh, there is a guar over here. Hi. I don't want to rest. I want you to cast this attack. Why aren't you casting or hitting whatever damn time? I don't remember seeing a Daedric Ruin on the map nearby. So I don't quite know... Well, there's that. So it really doesn't matter that we didn't take that. I think it's over in this area. But yeah, what I was trying to say in the beginning of this episode is... I've done this quest without actually doing the quest. It's another doing a quest without doing it because it's supposed to be like... A unique artifact or something and there was like a playthrough I had where I just literally went and got all that stuff so I got like the Lord's Mel and the ebony thingy and this ring and another ring and just everything you can think of and I once knew all the names but honestly it's been years since I played the game so In fact, the last time I played the game was two years ago when I was recording it. And before that, it was another two years. Here we are. And before that... Oh jeez, I just wanted to rest, and then I'm going to heal, and then I'm going to mark, and now I don't have to be all pissy. I need to remember to do all that stuff, but yeah, it's been a long time. And before I did uh, started this back like in 2019, the last time I played Morrowind was in 2017, and before that it was probably like six years. Um, so fire is not doing much, so I'm gonna see if this will do something. That's what I say. Crap, man, that is. 
I'm actually M holding still. I don't know what the hell she's talking about. And of course, back then, when you play this type of game, you just literally go all out and just... Like, I remember just getting all the gold I possibly could, just so I could, like, make uh, enchantments, because they're fucking expensive. And... Um... And then I would make the highest, highest possible spells that could just kill people like in one hit. Yeah, that's for you basically. Um, so yeah, I would make these AOE spells basically, and then I would just, I had this like levitate spell that was like really fast and then just lasted a long time and <laughs> i i had like these fireball attacks that were on target max damage and had an area effect of like 10 feet or something so i just start flying over towns blasting these fire things it was fun i only did that like once though because it's not like my kind of thing but, you know, when you play a game, you want to try and experience all, almost all you can. Yeah, you could say that. Save. And... There we go. What does she have? She had a crappy sword. What the hell? Can I bring out at least one of my boners? I can. Or I can just fire, uh, cold her up. Okay, well, we're screwed because he's never going to be able to get out. You know, if this was Grand Theft Auto, she would die. Ah, oh, ash statues. Interesting. They are six house sympathizers. Ooh, another 100 lock. Oh, I want that. Oh, I want that. I can take it. I can literally take it. We will take it. I don't really want that one. I already have it. I will take that if we are able to. The ring is that way, by the way. I know that. She does not. Well, I guess I cast you for no reason, dude. Oh, and... Somehow already lost all my magicka. It's amazing. You know, when I played Adrian's Shadow, I, I was able to keep getting a lot of magicka potions from the... Oh, I guess it wasn't magicka potion, it was health potions. Health potions are kind of easier to get than magic potions for sad reasons, I guess. For some sad reason, if I can speak properly. Um, we need... What do we need? We don't need health, so let's actually do stamina. And then this. And then recall... Oh, and... Alright, I'll take this, and this.
Ooh, I want this as well. I really hope at least one of these rings is good. Ring of soul detaching. Holy crap. Weakness to all the elements and then soul trap. Well, obviously I'm taking that. It's a good ring. And in a crappy ring, and a crappy ring, and a crappy ring. Save. That is now cannon. Oh, there's an area down there I can, like, get to. Oh, I thought there was. I must have saw wrong. I don't know where that girl went. I don't see her at all anymore. But we'll go this way and take care of the enemies here. Alright, bring out one enemy, she's kind of pretty. Very pretty actually. Apparently the first enemy was the most difficult. Moria. That's a cool name. Well, you had a decent club. I hate when that happens. I hate when that happens. I would have been a little bit more worried if you had a sword, but you just had a dagger, so... Crap. Nothing but crap. A hundred gold. Nice. Uh, I probably will take their food rations if they have anything good. They do. It's more for alchemy, though. Alright. There's that lady in the water that's really pissing me off. I don't even know where she went. I can't even see her. Ah, she's over there. Did she, like, die or something? Well, my character's not water, doesn't like water at all, so... I don't know what to do about this. And also, I kind of need to... go back... and get more Magicka. I might try some ranged damage for her. Minor healing. Stamina. Save. All right, so. She's a dark elf, if I remember right. So, let's go with cold. No, it's not working. I don't know how to take care of her. But I want to... I want to. Actually, there's a way to do it by kind of going over on this side over here. Come on. I 
I think I can get back up this way. You can come over this way, lady. So we can, like, actually fight. Too bad you can't summon, like, water enemies or whatever. We're about equal right now. I'm on land. She's in water. She has to, like, try to float. But she's probably better with a sword than I am. So I think it's an equal battle. Do I have the right sword? You know, I could paralyze her with this amulet of admonition. Apparently, it doesn't work. All right. Well, let's get a quick health potion on the way. And... Come back here. The only thing that I would say is not a fair fight in this is I'm actually going to be able to use potions. I mean, she could too, but she doesn't seem to be. This is slightly um, uh, uncharacteristic. But at the same time, kind of not. Or, I wouldn't say it's kind of not. I would just say it's not too uncharacteristic. Okay. Would have been nice to know beforehand. And let me get a light potion. Just one more hit with her. There we go. Look at all these bows. Two bows, a chitin bow, three, so three bows. And three uh, long bows. A short bow, five steel bows. Jeez, she had a total of... 12 bows. Jeez. Maybe if you had more arrows than bows, you might have had a better chance. There we go. Well, actually, we're going to have to go and do this one last time. <clears throat> At least in the fight itself. What time is it? almost time to sleep for the character uh, yes stamina please and then another one and then a recall and then let's save right here
And now let's go and fight the most difficult enemy here. At least I remember them being difficult. When I tried them, yep, there they are. Ooh, nice effect. Too bad I can't see what that is. Um. What is that? Oh, sound. Oh, it actually gives sound now. It's a little bit annoying, but I thought it was a girl that we had to fight. And then let's go with... That's cold. Alright. I would like that a black shirt within the exquisite range, but whatever. I guess it was a little further on. I don't remember fighting anybody here. I remember fighting them there. I don't think there's any way they can follow me up here. But maybe they are. Uh, let's go do this. Uh, protect me, please. Oh. Dunmer so cold. Alright, I guess we are going to have to do this one more time. And we're going to have to... Oh no, it's not a glitch. Good. I thought I had the glitch going on. Alright. That and that. Restore this. Recall. Save once again. Let's go in and take care of this enemy here. I thought it was a girl that we had to get the ring from. Maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm thinking of a different ring. I did think it was a little bit more south than this area. There it is. Fortify agility. Taking that. We finally have a ring that we're going to keep. I might not even bother upping my agility because that's pretty good as it is. And... Oh, she wants one of these. And one of these. But we already have one so we don't need too expensive. And a crappy axe. Wait. There we go. So let's see what's up here. Because I swore it, I got it from a girl. Giggity. A lot of clothes. Um, anything here that we might want to use. Not going to trust the food in here. Man, a lot of hundred lock scrolls now. That's really nice. I'll take it. Oh, I'd like to, but... I can't take the armor if I do take it. I think this is a quest. Like, you can uh, help this guy. Oh, here's some divine interventions, which is what he wants. Apparently, you can keep giving him scrolls and he'll keep giving you... Oh, I really want that. I don't care about that. But yeah, you can keep giving him scrolls and... And... 
he will keep giving you the reward or something. Got a new piece of soap. Uh, we do have stuff like this, and this, and this, which was in here as well, I believe. Just one, but it's better than none. All right. Yeah, I already took care of them. So, divine intervention? Give. And I th let's just test it. <laughs> the the Marwin patch didn't fix that? What the hell? Uh, I picked up two and I already had one, so I gave two. I don't want to do that anymore because that's a bit strange to me. But that is kind of funny. I could have kept doing it for two more times, I guess. I wouldn't want to do that. That's a little cheaty. Um, charm. And I, I wouldn't want... I don't want these anyways. These aren't things you would use. I mean, a charm, yeah, but... We already have a good charm. Up, oh, time for our simple key. Simple key to get how much gold is that? 56. Good uh, exchange plus an amulet. Um, Guess we didn't, um, 45 fatigue, not worth a lot either. Guess we didn't absorb that, which kind of sucks. We can take that, we can take this, and that. Alright. Uh, we're gonna need this. That we did absorb, but it didn't matter. 400 gold. I'll take that. I'll take that any day. And then there's, like, yeah, scrolls. I thought so. I'll take them all to sell. Yep. Take that. I'll take that. Uh, 80? No. 80? No. No. Mmm. Just, like... Help out. I could use a feather right now and take the armor. Actually, I might just take the armor from him. Actually, I don't want the armor from him. She wouldn't do that. Pretty much out of magicka, so we're gonna have to... Do the rest without light. Over by two. But we do have this potion we just got. And there we go. Plus, I'm just going to do this anyways. And one last time for now. We'll restore... Our Magicka will give ourselves some stamina. Um, I already fought him, dude. I already fought him. Uh, we're over encumbered by one pound and I'm okay with that. Let's just have a piece of bread for to eat. Um, uh, I don't 
need anything from here. I guess I'll just use lightened load. So I have shink for one of the things that we need. And the other place the ash ghoul is for him. The ring is for the imperial cult. What did uh, Aryan want me to do? Shy Shy. Okay. Yeah, we had to go all the way to the west coast. We'll do that in the next episode. Whatever. Don't be a dick. Um, duties. Ash School. Yeah, here it is. Uh, kinda, but I actually have had harder quests to do, do, so yeah. One last quest from him, and we'll do that after we do our Telvani stronghold, because that's where we're gonna get these. Banishment? No, we do not. I guess not. So, where do we go? Ebonheart. Let's get this stuff taken care of. Travel, Vivek. I didn't think we had a. We do. I wonder when I got that. Anyways, let's go to Divine. And we'll end it off here. Did it? No. There we go. Also, let's get rid of... This. Because it messed up our agility. And sometimes it gets really weird if you... Alright. Yep, I have it. Oh yeah, I found John Hawk Hawker there. Yeah, I'm glad I get to keep the ring. I was kind of worried about that. Um, let's get the next quest from you. Boots of the Apostle. Tiber Septum, you say? Cyrodiil, you say? Talos, you say? Boots of the Apostle. Dunmer Scout, you say? So, we have to talk to... Nalasa Serothrin. Cool. Balmora, huh? Well, normally I would go to the inn, but we're already kind of over, so actually, I'll make my way there, and that's where I will start the next episode. Anyways, I hope you guys all enjoyed this time. Um, we actually got a lot more done than I kind of thought we would, so that's always really good. Uh, next episode, we're going to do the um, Imperial Cult stuff, and then we're going to head on up to Shai Shai, and I think that's about it. All the while, uh, once we get Shai Shai done, I think we're going to be able to level up by then, hopefully, otherwise I'm going to be very upset. Um, beds, yes, I said yes, barter, do we have any bread, very little, let's get the rest, what the fuck, okay, let's make potions then, always something at the end of an episode that just fucks everything over, isn't that great? I love it. It makes things very unique. 
There we go. About damn time, huh? Get the hell out of the way. Um, other than that, I can't think of anything else. Mostly I'm wanting to get the stronghold done, but that's about it. Seven hours, and we're good. Oh, level up. Three intelligence, two to speed, and I think we'll bump up her strength just one more, and that'll be it for the strength. Alright. I hope you guys all enjoyed. Love you all. Peace to you, and as always, stay safe.